Okay, here we are now wiping down and thoroughly, thoroughly cleaning the shampoo bowls and chairs. So Jen, what are, your, what are you touching on here? So the biggest thing that I wanna make sure we're doing is not just surface cleaning, but also cleaning in these crevices Yum. that have not been cleaned in. So pulling it back and really wiping that down. And then also down in here, in between where the bowl and the chair meet, really being thorough about that area also. Yeah, I like to stuff the rag just like Jen's doing. It's a tight space, so sometimes my hand doesn't fit down there great. So I just shove the rag down there and just like Jen's doing, shimmy it back and forth. Um, in regards to the cracks, uh, she just pulls it apart. If you need a buddy for this, like if you need someone to come and help you pull back while the other wipes, that's a great option too. Another thing about the chairs that gets really dirty is the headrest. Um, hair and shampoo color collects in here, so you want to make sure that you spray that down really well and clean inside the headrest and also inside the shampoo bowl where it sits. Another um, area that we want to make sure is getting wiped down. You are, as Jen demonstrated earlier, you should be sweeping down the footrest and also wiping it down. We just want to make sure it stays really nice and clean and shiny. People's feet get on it, so sometimes it needs more than just a sweeping. And also just make sure you're hitting all the sides of the chair including back here in the back. And lastly, um, also just making sure getting really close to the um, water spigot and faucet over here. Again, if you need to grab a Q-tip or a toothpick to help get this grime, um, you can do that also.